Cash money. We sit, we stick it up and count it. Yeah. All right. So, what is this? I just sold a pair of the Yeezy Zebras. Four, one, two, three. So that's um, it's too large right there, and um. <clears throat> Back in the pocket. So it's the Craigslist thing, you know, like a couple tips of how this will work. I'll make this quick because I'm in the middle of cooking. Speaking of cooking, I'll talk about cooking in relation to sneakers at the end of this video. Um, so Craigslist, you know, buying and selling cash. So you got to live in a major city. I just moved to New York. You can do this in New York, LA, Miami, maybe like Houston or something like that or like Boston, I don't know. Either way, you need to deal with people that have some cash. And you need to deal with people that are ready. Because otherwise, you can get screwed. This was kind of risky, because I've gotten robbed before. But, you know, I met this guy in a bank lobby. And um, he was taking precaution, too. He, he saw the shoes. He verified they're cool. And then he went in the bank lobby, withdrew the money, and came out and met me there and we made the exchange and then we both parted ways separate ways so um it was all good but what i did i didn't even i didn't even get these from retail for retail i got them off craigslist and then sold them again on craigslist so that's a way to make a little profit i got them for 1500 i sold them for two so i didn't make two thousand dollars i made five hundred dollars and that's pretty cool for like i don't know i probably had the ad sitting up for like three days so it's not bad for like three days. We're just chilling. And then it takes some balls. It takes a little bit of trust. Um, you have to very much... You have to kind of test that the guy is true to his word. Uh, you want to, before you meet him, get him on the phone. If he doesn't answer a phone, that's always shady to me. Second, build a little bit of rapport. You get a kind of feeling. If he's like too, too friendly, then shady. If he's like real standoffish, it's shady. Like, if he's just chill and he's like, yeah, man, I'm ready, whatever, I just want him, they're my size. And then, you know, like, he doesn't mind paying up because I try to show that I deliver. I try to show that I stay true to my word. And it works. You get these kind of clients. You get the big money clients. And you bet, you bet, you bet I saved his number and he saved mine. And I was like, I'll hook you up on future user releases because cooking you know that's that's the term used for for botting sneakers online and i'm 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 doing a lot of learning about it i won't i won't claim that i know much about it right now but i'm learning it takes a lot of knowledge and that's going to be in my second ebook coming soon next month april 2017 i'm going to teach you how to cook i going to teach you how to get some like six up to six maybe even like multiple pairs of the next yeezys um, I'll be using my techniques hopefully to get those all white easy. So, uh, anyways, great talk as always. Deuces, and I wish y'all the best.